Everyone gushes over the killer Kuma, but you have yet to meet his beautiful wife. Hi, buddy. Hi, little buddy. Up, up, up. Thank you. Go on, go on. Please stand up, Yumi. Thank you. This is Yumi, and she's a four year old American Akita. I have been grooming Yumi ever since she was a little puppy. And she definitely turned into one gigantic beast of a dog. She's even bigger than Kuma. But maybe let's just blame that on the baby weight after having two litters. What? Don't show me those teeth. Those teeth. Yumi is shedding enough coat to insulate an entire home. I'm using my de-shedding nozzle first because as much as we love Fernados, it makes cleaning up my shop very difficult. Although don't worry, she still blew a tornado anyways. This is the aftermath of the nozzle, and that's only a quarter of the amount of hair that came off of her today. Oh, you're such a good girl. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. The face of an Akita with a personality of a golden retriever, this one here. She was a little dramatic about wearing the happy hoodie today. Okay. Like that. Yumi is very itchy due to all of her compacted undercoat, similar to how a bear rubs himself on a tree to shed their winter coats. The skin can't breathe properly when the hair is stuck. You'll notice she isn't itchy anymore after her blow dry. I brush her with my slicker brush, and then I am still de-shedding her after with the Equi Groomer. The amount of hair that she's losing is insane. Using my flea comb, I remove some of her eye boogers. And some eye gunks. Yeah. And then I shave out her paw pads. I sprayed her down in Italian lemon and sugarcane cologne, and she's still shedding. Here is the explosive aftermath of her grooming. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the malting Yumi.